So, that Tevinter guy sent you into the future? Ugh. If you're worried about magic, I can protect you. My blade pretty much protects me. Perhaps I can do things your blade can't. I don't know. It has blood grooves. Well, technically, it's the fuller, but blood grooves sound so much more violent. Anyway, I hope our new friends have what it takes to close the breach. The damn thing gives me a headache just looking at it. Can I help you? See you later, Bull. See ya. Have you seen the horses Master Demo sent the Inquisition? They're magnificent. There was never going to be an easy answer to the mage dilemma. What you did for the mages took courage. You gave them a chance. Everyone deserves one. Something on your mind? Mage Rebellion joins the Inquisition. I've got to admit, that's a twist I didn't see coming. One thing you saw in the future worries me. I mean, it was all bad. But Red Lyrium and Ferelden infecting people and growing out of them, that's bad. Finding more of it really punches a hole in my Red Lyrium at the temple was a coincidence theory. How long does it take for Red Lyrium to grow? How fast can it spread? It took years to infect people in Kirkwall, but no one there was actually ingesting the stuff. This Elder One managed to take the worst thing I can think of and make it worse. That's an accomplishment. We can't leave a single piece of that Lyrium out in the wild. I'm with you on that. I've got people trying to find out where the red stuff came from. I think maybe we should make that a priority. But that's enough doom and gloom. You just won a big victory for the Inquisition. What are you going to do to celebrate? I was planning to put my feet up. Maybe grab a nap. You? Whatever I do, it'll be as far from Cassandra as I can get. Things should be calm around here for at least the next hour. Take a moment to enjoy it. If the world's about to end, I'm sure the Seeker will let us know. Need something? Can I ask you something? You want to talk about me? <laughs> I'm flattered. Also, another time, Varric. Good day to you. Well, that's mages all over. So many robes. I bet all of Ferelden lost their curtains. I'll just be the other side of Haven, just in case. These mages are here to aid the Inquisition. Don't worry. Sure, don't worry. Magic up there, magic down here. What's to worry about? I mean, yay, freedom. Great for them. Over there, away from me. The Inquisitor's work is never done, I see. It seems Blackwall knows nothing about the disappearance of the Grey Wardens. It's a disappointment. I am, however, glad that he is with us. Even if he was not what I expected. He seems to be a good man, and his experience will be an asset to the Inquisition. <sighs> As for the other Wardens, I suppose we will have to keep looking. In Redcliffe, you sacrificed yourself so that I could return here. Of course I did. One small life in exchange for a second chance at history. I always loved a bargain. It was still a sacrifice, and still noble. And I would do it again. Anything I should know? 
Altegan has returned to Redcliffe Castle and resumed his duties as Lord. The people are returning, slowly but surely. Unfortunately, our show of support for the mages has angered many. 